visit Mech. These two do not often meet in serious conditions at locals. Often they're both kind of like, you know, either busy or goofing off or, you know, something like that. They have some back and forth. Yeah. But with various levels of seriousness. And but I think today it's, it's serious. This is the big right? one. Loser goes home. Winner also goes home, but later and with more money. Yeah. But neither one has to drive particularly far. That is true. And so we've got Fox Ganon. Fox Ganon. Starting on Yoshi's, which is bold, I think, for Scarzo, right? Like, I think right. that Fox is absolutely fine here. But what that tells me is, like, you know, you're d you're you're down to scrap, even though this is probably the stage game is the happiest on. Right, and we talked about this in the Magi set. Ooh, good wow, use of the lift a, by Mech. Yeah, what a crazy way to kind of get out of that nair string. So like, does Ganon have good stages or just less bad stages? Ooh. Right. Mech testing the execution well there, just doing the jab, just to show Shigerzo that he was a little bit late on the tech chase. Wow. Ooh, nairing right into the forder. That is what you do not want to do. Just jumping right into the grinder. You know, I think it's really tempting as Fox to just nair, you know, at Ganon, and it can be very good. Oh, God, but I'd I think love you to do it. To, you need to already kind of be within a certain range, because the one thing he's always going to do if he has the opportunity to is throw a fair out. That's right. You just want to make sure you don't run into that. It's kind of scary watching Scarzo give up all of the space, though, as Ganon does, you know, kind of throws his fists around, swinging them, right. saying, if you get hit, it's not my fault. Totally. Ooh. I, I, Kind of every time I see the crowd from Ganon in the Whoa. corner, I think it's it's down B time. Yeah, down B is definitely the classic. Uh, you got to watch out for down B. You got to watch out for side B on a similar kind of note, but I think down B is really the one that uh, is just very likely to happen out of the corner. Especially because if you full jump on top of it, sometimes yeah. it sends the wrong way. You can I die know. really early. Very dangerous. Oh, that up tilt is pretty crucial from Scurzo, but does okay. get grabbed. Mech getting the chain grab. I like that he's kind of giving Scarzo time to mash and maybe not DI is, is tricky and missed the tech right. there, actually. Wow. Just a kill. Great percentage knowledge for Mech. Yeah, going for stomp there is uh, yeah, pretty smart, I got to say. Very good. So Scarzo's actually been pretty good about just saying, like, okay, what mix-up are you doing uh -oh. to neutral? I'm going to whip punish it. Might die. Ooh. <laughs> I mean, the shy guy probably made that time a little bit weird. Usually, you want to kind of, if you can, yeah, do like a little bit of a delayed meteor cancel. That's right. It's a hard timing. Yeah, because people miss it. it. People miss it by going too early a lot. Oh, oh God, we actually a got the spike. Yeah, yeah, because I think Scarzo missed the shine turnaround uh, back here and got forwarder instead. Okay, Scarzo definitely ascribing to the hit Ganon with something while Ganon is up being or down being, no matter how risky. School yeah, thought. for sure, for sure. Huge fair. And that's actually going to kill straight out. Yeah, that's the you know that's the the law of this matchup is you know Nair is good until you do it into a forward air, um, and Scarzo definitely won too many of those this set. Chicago watching nervously. Will it be the Cocaine Fox or the King of Darkness? That's right. Who will be their new ruler? And what sort of reign will it be? Right, right. What are the taxes going to be like? Is, that, is anybody getting fed? Yeah, I mean, either way, <laughs> there will <laughs> yeah. be hell to pay. <laughs> there really will be. Uh, stadium, definitely a classic pick in this matchup. Big stage o'clock. That was kind of a funny miscue. You really have everything here. You got big stage o'clock, and you got, you know, low blast zones o'clock. Yeah, you got... God, I'm going to up smash you at 90-ish and you will die. I can also wave shine you across the stage. Right. You're Ganon. You can SDI, but how good is it really? I can watch you just kind of do moves and, and pick which time I get to hit you. That like was a... And that didn't get punished. Up strange. tilt in the middle of the stage in the Magi set that didn't get punished. That's and right. up smash in the middle of the stage from Mech. Uh, sorry, uh, against Scurzo. That's right, yeah. Which is like, yeah. I mean, is that is that just is that fear? Maybe. But look how quickly Mech gets rid of the stocks when given the opportunity. Yeah, you have to. You really do. Ganondorf. Scares okay. are aggressively pushing Mech off the stage. Mm -hmm. Up then, smash. There we go. Just a sitting duck. But yeah, I mean, I wonder if it's some familiarity between the players that actually works against Scarzo a bit. Mech has a bit of an inclination as to where the techs are going to come in. Right, right. When the you know when the approaches might come in too. Um, because you know, yeah, that's a great point. Ganon's the, the character in this matchup that kind of has to make some reads. That's right. Uh, Fox gets to sort of play the matchup, so you know, in theory, yeah, that could help Mech out. Fox can kind of goof around a little bit. Jab, jab, up smash. Yeah, yeah not going to take it off the top quite yet. Uh oh. Yeah. Ganon tournament winner, notorious, so so high, but I, God, that makes me nervous every time Scarzo goes into the corner, lasers, lasers like that. Yep. Yeah, you got to be, you know, just make sure that you're not giving uh, Mech any. Any free approaches to take stage? 
Oh, wow. no. That could have been a bonkers up air trade for Skurza, but only got the first hit. And Mech is going to really just tap that one in with the back air. Mech's been tapping in a good amount of them this set so far. It's worked out. Up I a mean, game. if Mech wins here oh, on no. Stadium, yeah, I thought that was going to be another up smash. Just react to the drift. <laughs> nice. <laughs> just gets under the legs, dude. I can't believe that happens like, like a that. circus performer, you know? Just tucks. Fox low riding and low profiling is, is kind of rare. Kind of, yeah, it's not like a chic or puff situation, yeah. but you know. Scarza in the corner again, though. If Scarza gets fair, oh. it's actually over. Yeah, but that could have been a shine, maybe. So that was actually a little bit dicey. Mech get, gets out of the situation okay. Kind of surprised not to see up there. Tech. For some launch. Wow, great job. See there? Just that's where Ganon gets to play when you're in the corner. Mm -hmm. Stay in the Pokeball, Scarzo. Oh. Wow, the DI was not there on the back air. Not at all. Skurzo getting sent to the blast zone. And you know, if Mech takes game two on Skurzo's counterpick on Stadium. That's very rough. Yeah, that is a bad sign for Skurzo's chances in this set, in my opinion. Okay. Great read there, but Mech's going to be invincible, and he's going to try kicking him. Yeah, he really is going to try kicking him. Nice. SDN out of the drill, getting a grab. Uh, not trusting the chain grab at 26. I think it's pretty tough. You can start going for it now, though, probably. Yeah. So you really don't want to get grabbed if you're... Scurzo oh, this here. is big. It's Nair Fair. Yeah, 103 off stage. Good What's the I? recovery? Oh, oh, crazy ledge dash into up tilt right and now there. Now a bad trade is going to come for one of them. I can for feel. one of them, it has to. Yeah. Yeah. Call an Roll. ambulance. Yeah. For who? Who is it going to be for? Oh my God. Uh, oh. And Scurzo trusting the ledge dash. Oh, that's a, that. That might be everything. It's the ambulance for Mech. It really no, oh, it's Skurzo. Skurzo. Skurzo not doesn't for me. hold on to the ledge. Could have put the control, but ah! Mech doesn't grab the ledge. What are you doing? They forgot that that's a mechanic in the game. I did too, and the Tidman oh comes out. That's going to be game two, and just gracious. truly just evil, miserable throws. Skurzo with like a smile, but like a yeah, like, you that know, hurt. Is it? Is it? Is it? Huge advantage. Is it the for kind Mech. of smile that says GG's on the outside, but it was more of a BG's? on the inside. You almost want, you want to see fire, you don't want to see the Ganon devastation mentally. Yeah. That was. Well, I mean, that, that one went both ways. They both kind of yeah. gave up the ledge for free. Uh, it wasn't, it wasn't like, uh, it wasn't like Scarza was leading and then just like got grappled, we'll say, right? Right, right, right. That no, was that just, was a, yeah. A little bit spooky on both sides, honestly. It's one of those games where you lose, you just kind of question, do you have it inside you that day? Is the right. dog, is the dog present? Right, maybe that dog is, out of town. Yeah, maybe. Oh my goodness! Finally, that 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 spooky laser you've been talking Monster about. Monster Double double. Yeah, it's just every time in the corner. And Mech is super good at finding those. Like here. Yeah, more lasers. I mean, you know, I I do kind of wonder on on Skirzo's end. Is it just wow. too much autopilot? Yeah. You know, a lot of auto. Did the little Ganon slide that I don't know how that worked. I I'm works. never understanding how never he's so really slippery. Ganon. And that's this. just a read. It's just a read. Gets the yeah. grab. The chain grab's coming out. Gets oh, the stop. Oh, and he knows he knows tech isn't coming either. Right. Because uh, if you try to tech the first one, it's just not happening. Okay. Oh. That's Skirzo. happened a couple times. He's just missed two wave shine. Uh, you know, after the drill. Right. Oh, that's a really bold down beyond the that corner. Was, that was ambitious. It was ambitious. Yeah, because Skurzo's yeah. on the platform already, you know? Skurzo in the corner, met correctly, knowing. Skurzo's still trusting those ledge dashes. God, those lasers gets, do get scarier every time. I guess the thing that I'm not, like, a huge fan of, and, and the reason I keep harping on it is that like, yeah. there are some characters where you can just reversal, right? Get the back throw, right. something like that. It's a trap in the corner. Ganon, unless you're trying to get to specific, like, you know, percentages. Which you're not. Right, you're a little not bit. really. Like you want, Scarzo wants his moves to make in and get hurt. I guess. Yeah, no, like, it's not it's CC, true. not ASCI down. And but now like it's at this up percent, smash. you know, we've seen him laser when Ganon's at like 110, and yeah. it's like, do, do you need that damage? You know, he's at he's at 110. Scarzo definitely needed that. He was missing a lot of the techs off of. Yes. Really, most of what Mech's throwing at him. Rolling, Good roll rolling in. through the pressure. Yeah. But Ganon's will see that coming. Up air, up air. Yeah, you can't be too predictable with it. Wow, that the second side tech. works. Yeah, super important tech to hit. Skurzo. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Both of them. <laughs> they got their. <laughs> and like 10 damage from lasers right there, maybe more. But Skurzo's lasers are actually very, very funny. Sometimes, the, in some ways, those worked out pretty well, actually. Yeah. Because, you know, if you can get the Ganon antsy, that's one way to try to win neutral. But. God. Last stock for Skurzo right now. Is Mech going to take a 3 0? Do we have. A new Dark King of Chicago with a Ganon. It hasn't wow. been Ganon for a while. It really hasn't. Okay. You'd have to go back to, like, I don't know, Eddie? I mean. For Midwest Ganon. For the Midwest, yeah. Dominance. Oh, and that DI. 
Skurzo still uh, insane ledge dashes in the heat of battle. And I think Mech is actually pretty smart to challenge them with the resources that he has in the game. Yeah, and up smash. Wow. Okay. Okay. Skurzo got to really keep it composed. One big fair is over. One big back air is probably also over for Mech. And you see Mech just saying, like, yeah, you got to come in. You got to come in and lay a lot of lasers, a lot of coming in from, from above with yep. the Nairs. And that's kind of what Gannon's looking for. Forner is going to do a 3 0. A solid 3-0 for Mech. And I got to say, on Mech's end, I just feel like there was a game plan. There was. In a way that I didn't feel was so pronounced from Scarzo. Yeah, you know? I mean, it's it's hard because hindsight's always 20-20. But when you see somebody sure corner themselves versus Ganon and then just... You got you to gotta ask yourself, what did they want? What does my right. opponent want? Yeah. And aren't you kind of playing to... Aren't you happy if you're Mech there? You got to be. You know, the risk, risk reward... Those lasers don't stun. Those lasers don't stun. They really don't. They really don't, and Ganon's got, you know, a heavy body, can take some damage, can take some of those lasers. We were talking about the concept of, in Melee, not giving your opponent what they want. Yes. Um, we talked about it in the context 